Okay, hello ladies and gentlemen and all my subscribers. Those of you that watch our YouTube videos and we say thank you very very much. This is 2017, a year where everybody must come back to agriculture to help save this country out of recession, help you yourself make money in agriculture. So what are we talking about today? We're talking about snail farming snail farming how much you can make money from snail farming business we learned about a woman called rosemary odinga from kenya she came to nigeria 2007 to pick snails and today she is one of the highest exporters of, of snail from africa so today we have started our own snail farm but i just want to show us what and what you need to put inside your own snail pen at least to increase the humidity to make the place more conducive for your snails and you make big money from your snail farming uh imagine when you start up your own snail farm uh, let me just say this snails lay between 200 to 500 eggs three times in a year so let's calculate with the lowest being uh the 200 so if you start your farm with let's say 1000 snails at least in a year and six months time you get 600 times uh, 1000 which is about 60,000 snails uh, 600,000 snails, uh, uh, pardon me. So if you have 600,000 snails and you decide to sell one snail, 100 naira, there's no way you get that in the market. That is 60 million naira for you. So I just want to ask you, how many business can give you that? But please, when you want to start up your own snail farm as a beginner, don't start with 1,000. Just start small. Because when you start small, you can afford to uh, uh, um, any loss. Because one thing you need seriously is knowledge and not just the academical knowledge but the practical knowledge and that is what we do here we can help you set up your farm we can help you in training and we have the information to give to you so join me as i show us what and what you need to have in your snow farm and uh, also show you some snows too uh, i believe it's going to be very very educating thank you very much as you go on from here okay as we proceed, I would like us to see some interesting things. You look in here, you see plantain. Okay, this plantain, uh, they are rugged crop also. Uh, when you water them, even if there's no water, you still see the plantain growing. You need crop that have shade like this uh, plantain here, just to increase the humidity of the place. Now, snows enjoy... They enjoy a place that has up to 75% and above humidity. And humidity is the amount of moisture, amount of moisture in the air. So please, you have to uh, plant some crops like plantain, pawpaw, inside of the place where you have your snow pen. And with that, you see the snows will be growing well. And uh, uh, all these uh, uh, high temperature and uh, low humidity that affects snow will not affect your own snow another thing you can look at here is uh these uh, uh, uh chicken uh, these uh, fowl native fowl here somebody will be asking what are what are all these native fowl doing here okay though we started with just one male and uh, one uh, uh female you know uh one cock and one hen but today we have all these uh this is about uh uh six months now that we started uh, putting the the, the, the the fowl here so you can see one thing this fowl does is to help in eradicating insects one of the enemies of snails are insects 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 are enemies of snow and uh, uh, they disturb a whole lot of snows so but when you have something like this they go around the pen and they help you to uh, get rid of those insects and before you know it your snails are growing well you see when we talk about tire pen as in how you you you, you do your tire pen with ten thousand naira, i do tell people you can start up your own snow farming uh business you see how we start the tire one two three four tires the first tire there is highly covered with sandy loamy soil and we also have net okay this is example of the the tire pen so but i want to go into the snow pen now to show us you see this hen here is already uh incubating uh the the, the 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 eggs and let's say in about uh, 15 days more now we have the little babies and